Wow, look at these tall, tall mushrooms. I mean, you gotta make up for the really small picture size somehow. Okay, yeah, let's jump right in. Hello everybody, VG Shine here, and welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario 64 DS. In the last episode, we finished off course 11, and in this episode, we're going to start tackling course number 12, Tall Tall Mountain, which is ironic considering how small the picture size is. Anyway, let's uh, go ahead and uh, scale the mountain for a star, you know, like uh, a lot of the other star we've, stars we've gotten in the, in the beginning of the game. Alright, let's do this, Yoshi! And, uh, yeah, I know I've been playing playing, play, playing with Yoshi a lot, but the, the thing is, is that, uh, considering the nature of this game, uh, playing as Yoshi is the only way I'll be able to, uh, get all the characters' power sets without having to, uh, go back to the castle and, uh, switching characters. So, there you go. We're, gonna be, we're basically gonna be playing as Yoshi for the rest of the game, unless there's a specific reason why I need to switch to another character. But, uh, yeah, anyway, let's, uh, go ahead and, uh, scale up this, uh, mountainside. Yeah. Yeah, you normally need, to, like, a long jump here, but, uh, we're Yoshi. We could just, uh, for a jump our way to safety, and, uh, wow. Yep, yep, this, this, this area is full of mushroom heads, like I said at the beginning of the episode. Alright, so, let's see. Well, am I, am I already at a loss at, at what to talk about? Wow, I am a horrible Let's Player, you guys. I am, I am so sorry. I, sh I deserve to get, I deserve to get crushed by those, uh, like, like, uh, like gopher guys. Wow, I, I, I don't even remember, they're Mon, they're Monty Moles. I didn't remember the name Monty Moles, wow. Yeah, this is a, an off day for me. I am so very sorry. But, uh, yeah, but hey! This this game has monkeys. That's that's, that's good enough for good comment. That's good. That's good content, right? Me 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 eating a monkey like putting it in my mouth. You kitty, don't eat me. I won't taste good, and I'll give you a terrible stomach ache. Help me, you kitty. Yeah. And yeah, and yeah. If you play as a, any other character, he will actually steal your cap if you do that. But uh, but but we're a dinosaur. We don't we don't need caps. So he had nothing to steal. <laughs> Instead. Oh, like besides some of my besides some of my saliva, but uh, you know I produce like a, like a lot of the a lot of that per day, like more than I'm ever gonna need. So uh, yeah, you're actually doing me a favor by uh, getting rid of uh, some of that saliva. All right, so yep, we are big Yoshi, which means we can like we can like uh, trample these 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 like little bowling ball things and like get 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 one ups. And yep, the yep, this 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 is definitely gonna help me in my want quest to. Uh, Get 100 lives, which admittedly I've been kind of neglecting until uh, Orsweiss pointed out that I'm still doing it. Alright, so... Ow. Alright, so let's see what to talk about. So, so yeah, I just uh, got my original Wii in the mail today, so... And yeah, and yeah, in case you don't remember from my previous episodes, I am trying to do a... Luigi's uh, Mansion Race with my Discord server, which is uh, happening on the 29th of this month, but I didn't have the all the components I need. Like I needed the game, I needed the system, I needed the memory card. I already had the con I already have a Smash Brass Smash Brothers controller, so I'm, I'm I was good there. But I needed like the other components, and uh, yep, uh, and the last component I need, my original Wii, just came to me in the mail today. So yeah. I am good to go, assuming of course everything works. Everything works as expected. I'm going to, I'm going to do a test recording with uh, with my with with my original Wii to see if I can play like uh, I can play like GameCube games on put, post them on my channel. So yeah, I'm going to be doing that test like uh, probably after probably after this recording and. Uh, and yeah, it, and yeah. It, by the time by the time this episode comes out, you'll probably have already seen the test recording. And uh, assuming everything works well, I'm also planning to uh, do a live stream of uh, of uh, Luigi's Mansion, like like, me, like basically me like going through the game quickly to unlock the hidden mansion. Which, uh, but and yeah, again, by the time you see this video, that uh, live stream will have already been have will have already gone and come and passed. So, yeah. Timing is weird. I am sorry. Anyway, this is another store where, once again, we need to climb this entire mountainside. Wow. 
Very original star ideas, Nintendo. It's, um, it's almost like 120 ideas was too much for you. Yeah, I'm just gonna meet you guys back at the top of the mountain. And here we are back at the top of the mountain. So th the difference between this mission and the last mission is that instead of a star, you got like a, a happy little monkey. Ooh, I like monkeys. Let's eat them. Okay, don't eat me. I was just monkeying around. <laughs> Can't you take a joke? Not really. If you let me go, I'll give you something really good. So, how about it? Hmm. A free meal or whatever the meal has to offer me. Hmm. I'll take what he has to offer me, and then I'm gonna eat him. Yeah, I think that's a smart choice. Ooh. And maybe I should think about the roasting him, make the meal taste better. Alright, come on. Give me to the thing so then I can burn you. Ah, so this is this what you want to show me? A star in a cage? <laughs> All right. Oh, crap! He ran away before I could burn him. I am sad. Well, I guess I won't be making the killing. The monkey, the noob, the way. Yeah, go watch my Dogemon Kingdom playthrough if you don't get that reference. All right. Yay! That's star number two, and that brings us to a total of 114 stars. We are just about three quarters of the way done with all the stars in this game. So yeah, let's uh, see if we can continue. And let's move on to another star. Let's see, what do we have this time? Scary Shrooms Red Coins. And yeah, normally the Red Core mission is where I go for the 100 coin star, but... Uh, I'm not gonna do that just yet. Uh, you'll see why in a few minutes. But for now, let's uh, go to where the mushrooms, like the like the like the mushroom uh, mountains are, like mountainous mushrooms. I guess well, that's, that's what that's what we're gonna call them from, from this point forward. So yeah, on top of these mountainous uh, mushrooms are some red coins, at least half of them, half of them anyway. So uh, let's flutter jump so that we can safely land on them without risk of falling down. And yeah, there's also black boxes. I don't know what's in them. Probably not important. Anyway, let's uh, grab s and the, the rest. The rest of the red coins are on uh, this. Uh, well, well, like like on this on this wall here. So let's uh, grab uh, three of them, and the last one should be up a little higher. Come on, come on, Yoshi, grab it. Thank you. All right, and uh, I think the last one is up a little more higher. Yep, there we go. Then the star spawns on another on another mushroom mountain below, but uh, let's uh, go ahead and uh, grab this uh, one up here because yeah, I mean, you may as well grab the green and one ups if they're just standing around. I mean, that, I guess that's kind of a biggie shine pro tip. If you see a green mushroom, grab it. Yay, number one hundred and fifteen. We are down the last of uh, five stars in this world now. Let's see. Can we get all the stars in this world in a single video? I would that would that would be that would be very nice if I could do that. In fact, you know what? I'm just gonna do this entire world. I don't really care how long this uh, how long this video is, I'm gonna do it. Alright, mysterious mountainside! And yeah, we are gonna have to climb a well ways if we wanna get this star. I mean, there might be a way to cheat this star, but uh Honestly, I'd rather show you guys the normal way to do it, and then maybe afterwards I'll try cheating it. All right, see you guys uh, where the where the star is, or at least at, the, at least to get the the area where the area the star is in is. I'm so good with words. All right, all right, cutting, cutting, like doing the transition now. Wow. Boo! Really, I did the same thing. Yeah, I swear. I'm like, I feel like I'm Porky Pig. Like uh, every time I do, I do these let's plays. It's like I, 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 like I mumble one thing, but then end up saying another thing. But so anyway, this is where the secret of the star is. So we just like 
So yeah, we just uh, touch this wall, like you know where the coins are that are basically pointing you in the right direction. Anyway, we go to this, uh, like the, I guess the painting. I don't know, but anyway, secret slide. Let's slide it! Yay! It's been it's been a while since we did one of these slides. Like uh, the last one we did was back in World Four, I think. Unless there's one I'm I'm not thinking about. But anyway. Yep, there's a crossroads here. We're gonna go want to go right here because straight ahead is a death is a death trap. You definitely do not want to go straight. That is a BG Shine Pro tip. And please don't take this pro tip out of context. Please, thank you. Okay, so anyway, let's uh, at the end of this slide will be a hole. And inside that hole is the star. And uh, what? Okay, the game cheated me. The game totally cheated me. I want I want my money back. Come on, this this game is rigged. Well, thankfully, thankfully if you fail the slide, you'll you'll when you go back to the world, you uh you'll uh start back at the top of the slide. And also the one-ups respawn. So if you can grab both one-ups, you can just uh, keep keep farming one-ups that way, you know, if you suck at the slide. <laughs> All right, let's, let's try this again. Okay, I swear, okay, getting off getting off the ramps in this version is kind of inconsistent. Uh, in fact, I should probably try jumping, but that that would probably that would probably be the safe bet. All right, jump! Oh god, where am I gonna land? Okay, I land safely back in the slide. Thank goodness. BG Shine Pro Tip: If you jump straight up a slide, you'll go back down the slide. Assuming, yeah, of course, there's no turns. And, uh, oh, they added a cage in this version. Wow, I guess it's so that you don't cheat and uh, skip out the, on the slide. Yeah, I was originally going to try to see if I could, like, get up here as Luigi, but uh, now I see that I can't really do that. So, yeah, let's just uh, grab this door and uh, move on to the next door. Hmm, this is going to make, like, getting the 100 coin star very interesting, because I have to get them all out here, because normally for the 100 coin star, I would, like, go for the slide first and then get the rest of the coins outside, but, yeah, this makes it so I have to get all 100 coins outside. This is going to be interesting, no doubt about it. Alright, what's the next star? Blast the Lonely Mountain. Okay. This could potentially be another star I could cheat at with Luigi. Let's see if I can do that. All right, Luigi. It's time for you to show us, once again, just how truly awesome you are. Hey, three, two, one, blast off! Wow. Or Slice, I am sorry, but in this game, Luigi outclasses Mario in pretty much every category. Yeah, the normal way you get this star is uh, you find like a pink bob bomb somewhere somewhere on the mountain. You clock, you talk to him, and uh, then you blast off to a cannon somewhere. But uh, yeah, this method is a lot easier. VG Shine Pro Tip: Helicopter Luigi is your man for pretty much any situation. Yeah, maybe I'll just word that better at, like when I do the editing. All right. So anyway, star number six, five. Secrets of the Mountain. Hmm. I don't remember this star. Is this is this a DS exclusive star? I'm not sure. Hmm. Okay, or slice just for you. I'm gonna play as uh, Mario for this mission. And I think I'm gonna go for the hundred coin star as well. So uh, let's cue the music. <laughs>
So yeah, apparently the secret of the mountainside is like a coin ring. So yeah, we basically had to play as Mario for this mission anyway. So yeah, I guess it's one advantage like Mario has over Luigi. Like he does have access to the wing, wing, wing cap power-ups. So yeah. So yeah, there you go, or slice. I am using Mario to the to the to his to his to his best degree possible in this in this game. So there you go. I'm doing it. I'm playing as Mario. You know, like the title of the game is. Yep, we are living up to the title of this game. Super Mario 64 DS. All right, let's. So yeah, I left one, like one coin in the ground because I'm a bit paranoid that because yeah, I don't. I'd rather the star not spawn like the middle of the air, like like outside the mountain, if I can help it. But uh, but so yeah, I'm gonna try to like grab 99 coins and then grab that last coin on the ground so that uh, yeah, I can get the 100 coin star safely. All right. Okay. Just grab two here and two more here. All right, 99 coins. So let's grab this last coin on the ground, get ourselves a nice, juicy 100 coin star. Yay! All right, so I think we just have uh, one more ring to go through and then uh, we'll be done with, the, with, our, with our current star mission. Alright. Okay, let's uh, not slide down the mountain. That would be bad. Alright. Okay, we gotta refuel our, we gotta refuel our jet engines. Alright, we are refueled, so let's uh, take off and uh, get the rest of these coins. Yay! And the star spawns on top of the mountain! Again! How many times have we gone up a mountain or, or tower or whatever just to get a star? It's does anyone? I want someone to keep track. I, I can't get, do a count of that because I'm too lazy to do it myself. All right, so we're actually almost there to 99 lives. So yeah, we are almost done with the 99 life challenge. I think we got. Yeah, I think we got like uh, um, like at least 20 lives uh, in this world of in this in this world alone. So yeah, I think by my calculations there should be. One more star, and that's breathtaking view from the bridge. And yeah, I know who we need for this one. It's a me, Wario. All right, then with that, we'll have uh, played like uh, with uh, every single character in this one world. So yeah, it's nice to bring everybody together to uh, pull their strengths together to collect all the star power that we need to uh, save the castle and rescue the princess or whatever. All right, well, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna see what's uh, inside the, these uh, black boxes really quick and then I'll meet you guys on the, at the top again. Woo! Oh man, could we get a bunch of one-ups here? Yes, whack-a-mole with Mario! Wow, this game's a, a bit hard, that, harder than I thought it would be. All right, come on. Yes, more one-ups! More one-ups! More one-ups! Wow. 97 lives! I Yeah, I think we've got this challenge in the bag. Alright, me and you guys at the top. Uh-oh. Wow. Close call, Wario. Close call. And with that, guys, we have 99 lives! The 99 life challenge is complete! Unless we can get uh, like 999 lives, in which case... Well, crap, I don't think we're gonna do it. And... Crap. We're gonna have to climb the mountain again. Alright, we made it to where the star is. So let's... Let's carefully drop down this bridge, which I don't think was in the original version, but they added it in this version to make it easier for the casual players. But anyway, let's uh, break this block and reveal the last star of this world. And yes, we have 120 stars. If we were playing the original version, we would be done already. But uh, since this is the DS version, we still have 30 stars left to go. So, I'll see you guys next time when we continue on with Course 13.
It's sure to be a big one. Or a little one. I don't know. See you guys next time. Bye-bye. Ah!